1 0 6 first pitch. Opponents batting only 2 0 4 against the Nats trying to improve their interleague record to 4 and 2. Johnny Damon on a breaking ball in the dirt strikes out. And Robert Fick will throw him out. Southwest Airlines lineup for the Yankees. Melky Cabrera to follow, and then Derek Jeter. Giambi Rodriguez, the great Yankees, even without Gary Sheffield and Hideki Matsui. Big day for Johnny Damon. A grand slam, five RBIs, and four hits yesterday. But he has already struck out today. Yeah, what you did yesterday doesn't mean anything today. That's five right. and two thirds. This one flight out to center. Marlon Bird is right there, and he will put away that fly ball for the second out. Then Derek Jeter. Whoa. That's because they're on base a lot. A lot. And don't hang a curveball to Derek Jeter if you value your, your lips. 2 2. Oh, no, boy. throws the ball away. Yeah, I thought Jeter was going on that pitch. Mm -mm -mm. I've never seen that before. Look at him. He's just taking off right now. So you get a better job. Oh, maybe get a ball out of it. Now, why would Mike O'Connor even worry about him? Well, he did. He put something in his mind because he's a rookie. Steals, he steals. And if he strikes Hello. out, he strikes out, and the inning is over. Two Ks for O'Connor. He wasn't worried about throwing the breaking ball in the dirt with the runner at third, was he? And the National Southwest Airlines starting lineup featuring Alfonso Soriano two for seven with a homer and two RBIs in the series. More importantly Soriano has scored three runs in the two games. That's the bottom line. And he's tied for second in the National League with those 54 runs he has scored. Only Jose Reyes of the Mets with more. This is Chen Ming Wong spelled Wang but pronounced Wong and this guy is six and oh in day games this year. He must be hard to pick up defense and he's got a pretty good one out there. He's from Taiwan yeah. former member of the Chinese uh -oh. Olympic team and Alfonso Soriano out of the Dominican Republic with a base hit to start things off. The good youngsters on that Marlin club. Pedro with a slow bouncer to second. Cano to Jeter and the Yankees turn the 4 6 3 double play. Their 61st double play of the year. Jim Coleman toys toward prostate cancer research. Jose Guillen gets jammed and he serves one out into left center. Nationals have their second base hit. He gave up just one run in 14 innings, so he's hot. Darrell reaching for that one that goes dribbling by the mound, and Cano plays it very relaxed. Nationals get two hits and leave a runner and after one no score on Father's Day out of business right three two he walked him to lead off the inning next yes. there's a great pitch on the inside corner and Mike O'Connor gets his third strikeout big curveball that one got in on his hands, popped up, and Brendan Harris is there for the second out. There is able to go to work on you. What a great career. This ball hit to right field. Jose Guillen is right there. He will grab it about 370 feet away. Yankees leave a runner. They've stranded two. The red hot Zimmerman straight ahead. Yes. No way oh, we would have had that one. That's a lot of RBIs. Go on a pitch up, a swinging bunt. Zimmerman is. Whoa! He appeared to be there. Dan Isania punches him out. And right down to first for Giambi. Two outs. Got to pick, pick a pitch you like and swing hard in case you hit it. Ooh. Brendan did and flies out to Johnny Damon. And the Nationals go in order in the second. It looks like Wong and O'Connor are going to match up pretty well today. If a pitcher can help himself swing in the bat. Oh, let's see you later. That wasn't very long for Wong. So sure not too bad. 2-2 pitch. O'Connor 
goes with a breaking pitch. He left it out over the plate. And Johnny Damon will fly out high and far Ooh. on a fly ball that is in the seats at Yankee Stadium. Oh, but yeah. Not here. Yeah, that's fly to center. First time up. And when Tom's talking about centered, he means the center of that bat on the sweet spot. And Mike O'Connor's doing a good job of keeping the ball away from there. Ten pitches, 45 through three in a scoreless game. One ball and two strikes. Yeah, they've been winning most of the All-Star games lately and the World Series. Wong will do it himself. No need to chance a throw. It would have been a bang-bang play. Is the Sunday night game. O'Connor strikes out on three pitches. And Wong with his first. Soriano tried to pull an outside pitch, and that's what usually happens. Ground ball to short. He's gone, and so are the Nats. That's seven in a row for Chen Ming Wong. Scoreless game through three.